I'm meteorologist Annette Boerta, and this is your latest update on tropical cyclone Batsirai, seen swirling on our satellite loop. The cyclone is currently situated about 260 kilometers northeast of the island of Mauritius, and not a lot has changed on the movements and expected trajectory of the storm since our last update, and both the Joint Typhoon Warning Center and Meteor France are in agreement. The storm will slowly move in a west-southwesterly direction the next three days. Weakening a little bit this Tuesday, but Batsira is expected to strengthen yet again into Wednesday. By late afternoon, the storm will be situated less than 200 kilometers north of the island of Mauritius, slamming the island as well as La Reunion with winds gust of more than 100 kilometers per hour, possible up until at least Thursday. Intensifying further into Friday, now reaching intense tropical cyclone status, which is equivalent to a Category 3 hurricane. Both models are in agreement that Batsirai will make landfall over the central coast of Madagascar by this weekend, but there's not a lot of certainty where the storm will move as soon as it moves over land. Significant wave heights of more than 9 meters expected this week, close to Batsirai's eye, and also dangerous waves expected along the coastal areas of La Reunion and Mauritius, with swells of between 5 to 7 meters. Our latest accumulated rainfall model is showing most of the rain is expected to fall in the Indian Ocean close to the eye, but both La Reunion and Mauritius are on high alert for the possibility of localized flooding this week. More than 100 millimeters possible in the shade of white, which includes the island of Mauritius. And here in the black area, rainfall amounts in excess of 200 millimeters possible. This also includes over areas of La Reunion, so they will be on high alert for the possibility of life-threatening flooding up until Thursday. Just a side note, the cyclone currently has no threat on South Africa, and the Vox Weather team will continue to give you updates as the storm moves closer to the continent of Africa.